Hi, Brad from WPSites.net, solutions for WordPress. Uh, this video is regarding uh, moving Tumblr to WordPress. Uh, the latest uh, WordPress release, the latest update for WordPress includes a, a Tumblr import tool. So it makes it very, very easy to move all your blog posts, all your content, uh, all your images over to WordPress, your own self-hosted WordPress.org powered site, and I've written uh, I've written an article on uh, free hosted blogging versus uh, self-hosted blogging, and uh, in my opinion, I think you're far better off building up your domain authority and, and traffic to your own unique domain name which you own and you control, rather than using uh, an extension of Tumblr or Blogger or or, or another free hosted. Uh, uh, blog. So uh, I've written an extensive article on how to do this. It's very, very easy. It's just a matter of about 10, 10 or so clicks, and you can easily import your content. The first step is you'll need to create a new WordPress blog. Uh, I've written a guide. If you see here, there's a guide on uh, on how to do that, and uh, and there's also several articles on my site, and I've, I've put one link here to, to the, uh, the simplest one. So it's very easy to get your own WordPress uh, installation up and running. In a few different clicks you have to choose a domain name, choose a, a web host uh, for WordPress and install WordPress and that's very very simple if you follow the installation instructions there and the guide it's, it's very very easy. Once you've, once you've got your new WordPress site up and running then it's a matter of uh, importing your, your Tumblr content or your blog posts and your images. So uh, let's just take a look at how to do that. Uh, here we are at a fresh installation of WordPress. So if you've uh, you've chosen your domain name, you've chosen a web host, and you've installed WordPress to your domain name on your web host server, then this is the next step. And uh, log into WordPress and you'll find the WordPress administration panel. We've got the WordPress dashboard up the top on the left hand side you'll find tools. Uh, click on import <coughs> and you'll find a range of different tools. If you, you can actually use this, uh, these tools here to import from other free hosted blogging. But, uh, we're focusing on Tumblr so we'll click on Tumblr and it's a matter of installing the, uh, the Tumblr importer so it's already been downloaded 6,600 times. Click on Activate Plugin and Run Importer. Next step is to put in the email address for your Tumblr blog and your password. Click Connect to Tumblr. And uh, if you've got several Tumblr blogs, you'll have to choose the one you want to import. But, uh, it may take a, a fair bit of time for uh, the Tumblr servers to uh, to export your content, so uh, they can be quite slow at times. So, uh, over on the right hand side here, choose the Tumblr blog which you're wanting to import the content from, and click on Import this blog. And you'll see it's in progress now. So that's all you have to do. It's very, very simple. It's probably a little bit more complicated to get WordPress up and running, but uh, if you follow my guide and the posts on my site, you'll find it's very, very simple. And I do actually offer a free setup service. So, uh, so you can take advantage of that using my contact form on my site. So uh, I'll just pause the video now and we'll wait for this to complete and I'll show you the end result. But basically what it does is it'll just import all your content into your WordPress installation and, uh, and they'll all come in into the posts. They'll all be imported into posts, into separate posts. So uh, it's a very, very good tool. It's, it's only just been released today and it's the, uh, the best tool to use for importing Tumblr. Uh, blog posts into into WordPress. So here we are at the end result. Uh, the the WordPress Tumblr import tool has imported uh, 55 posts uh, from Tumblr into WordPress, and here they all are here. And uh, you can see the uh, the title of the post, which are on Tumblr, have been transferred across, and the contents been transferred across along with the images. So.
so uh, so that's pretty straightforward really then you can go along and you can categorize them if you like you can put them into different categories and or you can add tags or both try not to have too many categories but um, but you can easily do that you can you can just click on the post here and, uh, and then just assign it to a category and include tags if you like as well that's another way to group group uh, certain content together so relevant contents grouped together using the same tag and it can be used like a subcategory so you want the main category for a certain amount of posts and within those posts you can use use tags as well so so there you have it it's a, it's a great new tool that wordpress has developed and uh, and normally the tools that they develop at automatic which is the owner of wordpress uh, are excellent tools it's a free tool as well uh, but you'll need to install WordPress first and, uh, and, and you'll find the article, you'll find my guide or, or one of the, 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 the articles on my site under start a blog. Uh, very, very helpful when, he's, uh, when installing WordPress and, and starting your own, uh, your WordPress, own WordPress blog on your own domain. So, so there you go. Thanks for watching folks and uh, cheers and good luck.